Hey guys, another uh, <clears throat> ridiculous uh, food review video. You might have saw the last video I posted. Um, had to take it down. I was wearing my work shirt at the time. I'm not wearing my work shirt now and you don't know where I work. So don't bring it up. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. <sighs> Conflict of interest, I guess. And my face is kind of windburnt again a week later. And you didn't even see the video that I said that, so don't even worry about it. All right, this week I reviewed this place called, uh, it's probably backwards, but it's called Uncle Dave's uh, a Barbecue and Bar. This is the menu for it. This place in Sandwich looked pretty good. Um, one of my coworkers at this place that you don't know where I work at recommended it, not gonna say his name. And uh, his unnamed wife, I guess, used to work there for a little while. Um, and he recommended a, a really good uh, burger to get from here. So, um, this is some ketchup, I guess. I haven't even looked at this thing yet. Now, here it is. And this came with the, uh, here's my receipt. Some utensils here. All right, so, this place is called Uncle Dave's Barbecue. And, um, I walked, I'm just gonna give a quick story before I even get into this. Um, so I go into the place and um, I'm just like, yeah, I'm gonna have takeout. I'm gonna do a takeout. Um, I don't, I really don't wanna sit down because I wanted to record this. I don't wanna say what I'm doing. But uh, I'm just like, listen, when this food's getting ready, I'm just gonna take a walk around the restaurant, the bar, take a look at it, see what the deal is. Because I looked at the sign, it said it was established 2021, so but it's pretty recent. Really nice place. The setup's really nice. Um, this lady that was sitting down was actually like, hey, uh, is this your first time here? I was like, yeah, I was taking a look around. She's like, oh, it's really good. I'm like, that's good because I really, we don't really have a lot of barbecue places in Falmouth. And we started going over the places we did have in Falmouth, like Dogs and Hogs, places bullshit. Sorry if you like the place, but, you know, $8 hot dog, dry brisket. Come on, get the fuck out of here. So, um... Tourist trap is what it is. And then there's this other barbecue place, which is like a um, tow behind barbecue place, which is in uh, East Falmouth, right? So, uh, and that place is like hit or miss. The, the times I've gone there is good, but people, people have told me it's a hit or miss. Like sometimes like, their brisket is delicious and the next day it's dry. Who knows? It's a hit or miss. So with this place, um, I heard it was excellent and everything. Uh, yeah, so I was talking to those locals or whatever they were inside the uh, bar about uh, the place in Falmouth. And we're kind of getting into it. And then out of nowhere, she goes, that's Uncle Dave. And I was like, what? And then I go, Uncle Dave? And he goes, I'm Dave. I own this place. And I'm like, oh, okay. Hey, what's going on, man? He goes to shake my hand. He goes, what's your name? I go, Will. I'm like, oh, that's cool. Nice to meet you. He goes, first time? I go, yeah. I recommend this place. He goes, what'd you get? I go, um, well, this is what I got. I'll tell you. It's a, 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 a burger. It's a build your own burger, right? Burger uh, with uh, bacon, uh, mac and cheese, and uh, onion rings. And I was told to get onion rings on the side as well. Now, I was going to get that with cheese, but I was like, there's already cheese in the mac and cheese, so it might be a little bit, you know, whatever. So he's like, oh, can't go wrong with that. He's like, you like barbecue? I go, yeah, I love barbecue, actually. I, if I didn't, he goes, how do you like, you like brisket? I go, well, yeah, if I didn't get this, I would have got the brisket. He goes, let me hook you up. Go go over there, and I'll, I'll be right over. I'm like, all right. So I come over there, and uh, the lady hands me the food I ordered, and she's like, okay, thanks. I'm like, oh, I met Uncle Dave, and he said he's going to hook me up. She's like, oh, he's going to hook you up. So he comes back with this plate with uh, two huge, thick slices of brisket on it. And he's like, try this. And I'm like, okay. And you didn't see the brisket? Honestly, just go there and check it out. This brisket, I haven't had enough brisket, I feel like, to because I automatically want to get it at a 10 out of 10 because it's the best brisket I've had. But I haven't had a lot of brisket and the brisket I had before this wasn't good. So I'm not gonna be overzealous with this. I'm gonna give it an eight, seven out of 10. 
uh, but it's kind of hard to see a brisket better than that was because it was literally just falling apart in my mouth and it even the fat on it I was because usually I don't eat the fat off of stuff I just put it in my mouth the fat melted in your mouth man you didn't even know it was there it, it, it tasted delicious it was it was the guy told me the whole process he had like I guess he's he, you know he he smokes it for a certain amount of time and then he puts it in this other chamber that like makes it even juicier and then he puts it in this warming chamber that he, he, he tells it until he sells it. It's ridiculous. Anyway, let's get into it. Um, beautiful place, by the way. So this is the, this is their, um, this is their, uh, I got a, the burger with uh, bacon and mac and cheese. And um, these are the onion rings right here, which look pretty good. Onion rings. I've had this style before. Um, this is like homemade style. Seven out of ten. Now, look at this. She asked me if I wanted the um, onion bread uh, bun or the regular bun. I just said, give me the regular. That's the money shot right there. Look at that. All right, let's get right into it. Try this goddamn thing. Oh my God. Oh my God. Cooked perfectly. Mm. This is a huge burger, by the way. Look at the size of this thing. The size of my head. Look at this thing. That's a burger right there. It's all this mac and cheese. This burger is ridiculous. I'm not even messing with you. This burger. I'm not going to be able to eat this entire thing, but uh, just look at that. Look, I'll, I'll go like this. Look, see, look at this. Look at that. This is ridiculous. Mmm. Mmm. Literally raining mac and cheese. This burger is phenomenal. This burger, you know, let me tell you something. When you go to a fucking burger place and they're like, how would you like that cooked? I always go with medium because I'm afraid if I say anything more than that, they're going to burn it up. This place was like a pretty, looked like they shit had their shit together. So I, I, I was honest with them. I was like, give me medium well. And this is a perfect medium well. Oh my God. I literally need a fork and knife to eat this. All right. This video is going kind of long. Um. I'm going to say, now, I give honest reviews. This is my honest, this is a lot of food. When I ordered it, I'm going to be honest with you, thought it was a little pricey. Just because I was ordering a burger, and whenever I see, it started at 10 and every topping was like another $2, okay? And it just adds up. I get it. But this burger is like two meals, though. 
I mean, it really is worth the money. And also, don't be a cheap fuck. Go spend the money and get good food. Stop being cheap. If you want good food, you gotta pay for it. Why do you think it's good? Why do you think it's why do you think that they charge that much? Anyway, it wasn't too ridiculous. It's not gonna break the bank. Um, I give this burger. Oh, this is a really good burger. I guess it's a nine one out of ten. I'm not messing around. Nine one out of ten. I mean, I, I can't think of a better place to get a burger. I mean, goddamn. Mmm. Mmm. That's it. Um, eight seven with the, with the um with the with the onion rings nine one. I said, did I give about eight seven with the? I forget what I gave. I'm just gonna say eight, eight, eight out of ten with the uh, fries or the onion rings. Uh, nine one with the burger. Check the place out. Um, for real, it's in Sandwich. If you live around here, Sandwich, Massachusetts. Um, it's about a half an hour drive from Falmouth. I was gonna eat it there, but couldn't do it. Didn't want to do it in my car either. So I knew this was going to get all over me. All right. Have a good day. Like, subscribe, and...